I think this program is very important because I don't have health insurance right now and I, and I wouldn't have been able to um, get this uh, colonoscopy without this program. I had not been screened before due uh, to the fact that I never received a referral from a doctor to go and have a colon scope. It's not something you ask them for, I don't think, unless you're having symptoms. Uh, the nurse at the Christian County Health Department offered the program to us, to me, and uh, since I do not have insurance, this was a really good opportunity for me to take advantage of this program. This program is really important to me and it's impacted my life because at least for the next you know, four or five years I know I'm safe, I know I'm good as far as not having to worry about uh, colon cancer. When I'm getting to that age, I've had prostate cancer before in 97 and uh, so we had regular doctors up till a year and a half ago I lost my job. I got unemployment, we got to keep insurance, so that's why we had no any of the insurance now because we've been married 41 years and that it's, uh, we never had no problem with the insurance up to the last year and a half. That's the reason we're here to, to begin with because the program does have something good to, it helps us out a lot. I would tell my legislators if they, as they consider funding for this program is that there are a lot of people out there from the ages of 50 to 64 that have no insurance in the same predicament I was in. And this program can save their lives as well as mine. And I'm grateful for the Jessamine County Health Department that they have provided this for me. And I wanna give back in any way I can, so I tell people about it. I tell people about this program. I told a, a couple of friends of my age and, uh, you know, that they, I had told a couple of people about this program, you know, do, the, my age and my friends because I think it's very important because a lot of guys don't, you know, want to go to the doctor because, you know, they scared, you know, uh, that something might be worse than they thought it was. I think it's important to keep this program around because there's a need for it, um, not only for myself, but for others who cannot afford quality health care and cannot afford health insurance. My doctor set up and said it'd be a good idea for me to set up her and take it, and uh, it was free. And uh, you know, I went on. I was nervous, you know, uh, but I went on and said okay. If this program had not existed, um, I would have, both me and my doctor would have lived with the concern, you know, that I could be harboring something that, that was terminal. And um, there's always that question. Um, I, I really didn't know one way or the other. I just knew something was wrong and we needed to look at it. Without this program, I would have no idea. I think the legislatures should know that this is a very important program. People die of colon cancer all the time. And it's true, maybe our diet is not the best, but when you grow up on soup beans and cornbread and fried potatoes, it's probably not going to be the best. That's how I grew up, because that's all we could afford. So it's really important that people have available to them the opportunity of going and having the test done and having the treatment done. Um, that's why I came in today. If, you know, what I, if my, by my having the test, I could get treatment, and if somebody else could have the test and get treatment and save their life, then it's worth it. What, what value do you put on a life? 